listen, I can only speak on behalf of myself, but I, I think I've gained, you know, uh, great experience and knowledge from just playing, you know, in these in, in these different countries. What was it, Rush? You said it's like playing in a foreign country. Yeah, makes yeah. for you, mate. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. yeah, see where he's coming from. Yeah, he, he did eyes that, though, didn't he? Yeah. Yeah. I don't know whether you culturally understand how much of an impact you had on Robbie when you were playing together at Leeds because he taught you to cook, didn't he? Yeah, you remember that? Yeah, yeah. I mean, I'm, yeah. obviously, I'm a little bit older than you, but I mean, I'm, I burn toast. You know, I'm, I'm awful in the kitchen. I remember obviously being in your house and you cooking the tea, and, and it was simple. It was it was chicken with a, like a pasta with a tomato sauce. Yeah. I'm thinking, wow. <laughs> <laughs> well, and it was, you were like Gordon Ramsay before Gordon Ramsay was Gordon no, Ramsay. No, but you know, because, because I was in, because when I was in Italy as well, um, you know, I couldn't, and also, you have to understand, I lived on my own. Mm. Uh, I left Ireland at 15, went into digs, and by 18, I had my own house. So at the time, it wasn't really a big thing yeah. to let people go and, you know, to restaurants and, and get food because at that time, if people saw you in a restaurant, or well, I, was in, I lived in, in Wolverhampton and Telford, seeing you in a restaurant or a, or a pub, if you like, to get some food, to think you're on a night out. Yeah. And, and you know it's like yeah. years ago they used to like ring up the club and say oh I got seen seen Robbie Keane in a in a restaurant you saw the dunes going for dinner so I learned myself how to I, I learned how to cook very quickly at 18 years of age so and then I went to uh, Italy as well so and that was that, that was the same thing so I was shocked that Robbie uh, you know his fine age that he couldn't he couldn't even cook a bit of pasta I was 27 at the time <laughs> right, yeah. you take it on after that did you not really no I mean <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm there by the <laughs> <laughs> you need to <laughs> you're not wrong what are your memories of being together at Leeds it was a great side to watch that uh, we, we honestly I, I, I say to this day I mean I've been very fortunate to be in unbelievable dressing rooms but every time anybody asks me a question the air Leeds dressing room I think was, was up there with with the best honestly we had real good characters um but every, everyone was together wasn't it there was no there's no one really yeah like, there's no one of jealous of anybody everybody no wanted each to do well of course you wanted to play that but, but just the amount of the crack as soon as you walk in in the morning just people just battering each other till, till we let and we didn't want to leave the training ground did no, we? it's because when you talk i mean you mentioned before about the culture in italy and i mean the, the culture at leeds it was very very good so you go in there and you try and create an environment where you don't want to leave the training ground. you want all the lads to be comfortable and happy and you know be at, be as one and i think we, we had that leads didn't we mm, we had it we had big like really funny characters we had mm. gary kelly who was just he was different different class mr leeds he was there for a long time but just the way he was with the with the, the, the new players that came in uh, obviously i've been with the Irish team for a long time and the people like david batty who's the most laid back guy in the world would not, nobody has a clue now where he is, say, where is he now? people say we need to we <laughs> need to find a way we have a whatsapp group and we always say where's where's david batty we need to yeah, we need to find him yeah i have to do a book well, you know remember that like well there's where's wally where's <laughs> Bats, <isn't it>? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> So there's real, really big different characters, but really funny, funny characters. And then honestly, I had a great time. I think if we had a, if we stayed together for another year or two years, because of obviously the financial yeah. problems, at least they had to sell uh, quickly. With myself, was I think Rio's the first ones to, first ones to go. But it was a really good time, a really good part of my of my life, and, and even to this day now, said I've you know, really good friends in, mm. in Robbie, and as I say, we have a WhatsApp group from from that from that team. Um, so I would say now it was, it was very, very good. <laughs>